Hey, hey peeps. So it's been a while and it's a gorgeous day. So I thought it would be a great time to get all my jade plants together and give you guys an update. As it's actually been a while since the last time I've showed these guys off to you. And as you can see, quite a bit has changed. So I'm just going to give you the rundown on what's happened and what I've done. And you also get to see some progress on some other plants which are in this stone pot here. But all in all, the jade plants are looking great. So of course we're going to start here with these two here, this one and this one. And any of you that have seen my other videos, which I'll uh, link below if you want to see the other jade videos that I've done. But these are the ones that I started from a jade plant that I've actually had for whew, about 10 years now in total, but at the time it was about seven. And I had severely neglected it, so I took some cuttings and these two plants here are the result of those cuttings. And my gosh, they have grown. And they're about three years old this year. Oh yeah, actually they've just turned three years old this summer. And they just started out as little cuttings, like the size of when it focuses, like the size of one of these little branches here. They weren't that big, but as I said, I'll, I'll link the video below so you can see what they looked like when they started and how they looked when they were growing in different stages, but I am so pleased with the results. They really do look nice. So moving on, uh, this is the Hummel's Ghost cutting that I took when I chopped this guy back. I didn't actually do this one on camera. It was a spontaneous decision, as with the golem over here, but I'll get to that one in a minute. And I gave him a bit of a radical chop back a few months ago. And this was one of the earlier pieces that I took off, and it's actually grown quite well. A little bit wonky and ugly, but uh, it'll get there. But this is what's uh, sprouted up in the meantime on this guy. Hasn't really grown particularly fast, but it's some regrowth. I'm patient, so hopefully in time that will start looking gorgeous again. Because that's actually quite a beautiful thick trunk structure there. Okay, so and there's the shot of the cutting from it again. So I've just got those two of that type. So over here is my golem, and this one is the one that I originally had in that small terracotta bonsai pot. And yeah, I decided that he was getting a bit bushy and top heavy, so I took the risk and I gave him a very heavy cut back. So hopefully he'll be looking amazing within another year or so. But the regrowth so far looks great and it's actually happened quite fast because I did that about a month ago. So not bad, all things considered. And uh, that's just a small piece that I kept and I gave the rest of the curtains away. And uh, here's the other hard cut back I done. This is on the, oh gosh, I forget the uh, correct name for it now, the variegated jade. And this one had like two pieces, which I have in here, kind of hanging off the top of here. So I cut them back and as you can see a lot more has started to pop up and grow on the stalk. So that's doing well. So let's have a look at these. So I did this about again about a month ago and we've already got a root which is cool well actually two roots and coming on this guy look what I'm seeing nothing on this guy so far and over here is another variegated which is another cutting that I took from the main stalk over here at a later date this was actually done last year and that's actually grown quite a bit because when I uh, took this cutting it was like only four leaves as you can see now it's 
much bigger but this kind of jade just grows a lot slower but I don't mind I just love looking at it I love those leaves and the color variegations and the little pink tips it gets with the sun stress and when it was here this one kind of looks similar and it is actually a crassula but it's not a a jade jade like one of these this is uh, the rubra marginalis I just think it's uh, gorgeous and again in my other videos you'll see that when uh, when I first got this one it was just a few tiny little cuttings and my gosh it's grown I've got a few pots of this now it's gone crazy uh, if I can find a video with the uh, small cuttings and what it looked like when I started I'll, I'll link that one below but yeah I love it it's gorgeous and the cool thing about this one is is it actually turns that the same pink sun stress look that uh, the variegated jade gets so it's a nice compliment I find especially in the stone pot and that's my uh, ripsalis it's looking great it's also grown a lot so yeah that's enough of me waffling and uh, a nice quick update on my jade plant collection I hope you guys enjoyed Thanks for watching. As always, it's much appreciated. Much love, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.